Hey, what's up, y'all? Saying about another video. Today, I'm about to react to another video from Black Tea Blog. You know my girl, Ebony, period. Um, this video is called Nicki Minaj, Met Gala, Megan Thee Stallion Gets Chosen Over Beyonce. Kim K and Pete Go Too Far. Chad, we about to get to see what's going on, Shug. Um, I feel like about almost everybody slayed last night for the Met Gala, period. Um, yeah, everybody look, I'm, look pretty good. I really didn't see anybody that looked bad. Um, I think Kiki Palmer, she was looking, uh, sure, I don't know, sure. But, um, yeah, before we get into the video, make sure you got like, comment, subscribe to the channel. Make sure you got like, comment, subscribe to my solo channel. And y'all, quiz, I'm gonna call coin, 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 so we'll get some stuff done, period. But, um, hopefully she be in the next video, child. I don't know. But yeah, let's get to the reaction show, period. Hey, you guys. Welcome back to Black Tea. It's your girl, Ebony. Hey, Ebony. There are several topics that I want to discuss in this video. The first topic being none other than Megan Thee Stallion getting a lot of backlash after she received the key to Houston before Beyonce. Mm. Talk about a mess. Now, you guys know a lot of artists do look forward to their hometown giving them their own day. Mm -hmm. It does seem that Megan Thee Stallion, well, she got her day today. Go ahead and check this out. So as you see, okay, congratulations, Megan. Get a key to Houston. Now, as soon as this happened, people started voicing frustration, not because Megan didn't deserve it, but because people felt that Beyonce, the original age town girl, mm -hmm. should have gotten the key to the city before Megan. One user saying this: Look at this. Someone come look at this. Megan gets a national day before Beyonce. Somebody explain. Stuff like that hey, happens. Guys, while this looks very, very mean, this is actually not true. And I'm going to explain why this is not the way it seems. If you guys remember, back in 2020, when Beyonce did hop on the Savage remix, both Beyonce and Megan Thee Stallion did let all of us know that the proceeds from the song would be going to Bread of Life in Houston. During mm. this time, the mayor of Houston Houston, Sylvester, the person who gave Megan the key, offered the day to both Beyonce and Megan. But he okay. also had to emphasize that he had to schedule a time that worked for both artists, but was looking forward to not only giving Megan a day and a key, but also Beyonce. Okay. This is what but he Megan had was to say on Twitter. H Town's Beyonce and the Stallion dropped a new remix. That is just savage. Both of the artists contributions to uplifting our communities, holding down, and for helping us remain Houston strong. Our city will present both artists with their own respective days. Period. It's great to see proceeds from the singles purchase will support Bread of Life. Let's purchase and support this organization's efforts. I look forward to connecting with both artists to find a pro... Period. So was the first cryptocurrency but it's just the tip of the iceberg. Today, 81 at the top of one. Yo, I thought someone in my damn eyes. A reality. So as you guys see, the mayor wants to give the key to both Beyonce and Megan. However, Megan did it. have more time mm -hmm. and flexibility than Beyonce. So she was able to go get her get key. Get her I'm sure as soon as Beyonce is able to get her schedule in congruence with this actual ceremony, she'll be able to go get her key. Because Beyonce she always working on something. Beyonce, Beyonce, Beyonce probably Beyonce working on a new album show. Sure. The least, both or a movie. were offered this same award. Now, the next topic I do want to discuss is none other than Bruno Mars being accused of being ashamed of his skin tone by a videographer hey. who got fired after he said his skin was not light enough. Talk about a mess. And y'all know this is going to be a sip or spit type of tea. So mm -hmm. you can sip it or 
or spit it. We just here for the mess. Right. There is this blog that goes by Clatch, and they have a lot of gossip information on their website. And oftentimes, they are sent blind items. Now, this is what the person had to say. I'm a freelancer, colorist, and sometimes edit music videos. A while ago, I got hired to edit an R&B singer's video. He's in a band now with another singer. Mm -hmm. They're a duo. He told me he wanted the whole video to look lighter and brighter. And I was like, okay, no problem. The next day, my boss came in and told me they needed to hire someone else. I didn't understand the assignment and couldn't read the room. He wanted his skin to look lighter, but since it's a taboo to say or admit to that, they say lighter in general. For the future, I'll be aware, but it's honestly super sad. I thought he'd have a problem with his height, but apparently it's his skin tone. Why you gotta come for Bruno Mars? All right. Man? It's always people coming for the short men. Chow, allegedly. Chow. Thank you guys. I don't know whether this is true or whether this person is mad that they got fired because they did not understand the assignment. When I saw the... Well, we all know Nikki attended the um, Met Gala. Um, Kim, P, y'all just look like y'all need therapy. Kanye, go to the therapy session too, sure. Because I don't, I don't, I don't understand it, sure. Y'all need some help. Period. Um, Shell, talk about a mess like Ebony said. And, um, Megan and Beyonce, Megan got her keys to Beyonce. I'm gonna get her key when she wants to, Shugs, and we can't do nothing about it. But, um, let me know what you guys think in the comments, please. Let me know what you guys think about it. Um, let me know what else, else you want us to react to or me to react to. And yeah, make sure you guys like and subscribe to this channel. Make sure you guys like and subscribe to my soul channel, period. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.